The Nigerian Senate has condemned the continuous extortion and harassment of motorists and commuters by officers of the Nigerian police on the highways. The upper chamber also called the acting Inspector General of Police, Kayode Betokon, to direct personnel of the force to stop the extortion and harassment of motorists and commuters plying the highways in the pre pretense of conducting stop and search. This was sequel to a motion moved by Senator Onyeka Chipita, APC Abonyi North, at the plenary session on Wednesday. And movement on highways, <coughs> roads and streets open to the public. Further, notes that Section 49 Sub 1 of the Police Act 2020 as amended empowers the police to conduct stop and search while Subsection 2 empowers them to search and detain any person or vehicle where reasonable grounds for suspicion exist. Observe that Nigerian police force, which has one of its primary duty to facilitate the free passage and movement of commuters and motorists on public roads, has taken undue advantage by resorting to extortion, intimidation, and harassment of motorists. And worried that the continuous intimidation, harassment, torture, and torture that ordinary Nigerians pass through in the hands of these security agencies, especially the Nigerian police force. Other senators who contributed to the motion were Ishak Wabo, David Jim Kuta, and the Deputy Senate President Barao. In his remark, President of the Senate, Gatswila Pabu, urged the police boss to set up a committee to investigate the accusations of extortion, harassment, and killing against the officers. What I saw in the social media, where a human being was handcuffed and a vehicle passed or drew was drove on that person, is highly inhuman. And this Senate, the highest assembly in this country, must get rid of that matter. We should not leave it to be investigated by the police alone. We must investigate. We can't allow this kind of thing to continue. Those who have hands, the man who drove that vehicle, and those who were around, we must get them and we must investigate this matter. And besides that, we should call on the IG. The extortion going on on our highways should stop. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.